Hi and welcome back to my channel. Today we're back with another recipe for Valentine's Day and we're gonna be making these pink and gluten-free crepes. So let's get started. First thing here is that you can make it vegan super easy, just substitute the egg for the flaxseed egg and you can make them vegan, you just need to change that ingredient. And then another thing that I want to say is that we're gonna try to keep it healthy, you can absolutely use just like food coloring but we're not gonna be that boring today and we're gonna be using some raspberries to make it pink, so let's start with that. We're gonna put our raspberries into a pot at a medium high heat and in maximum 5-10 minutes it's gonna melt and you're gonna see that it's quite liquid but it has a lot of seeds and I personally don't like the seeds, so what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna take it out now that it's melted and I'm gonna rinse it and I'm gonna throw the seeds and keep all the liquid and juicy part. So now let's move to the dough. We're gonna start putting one egg and then we're gonna put half a cup of our plant-based milk and then half a cup of this raspberry juice that we just made and we're gonna start blending that. You can also add a little bit of sweetness here or later on which is gonna be some maple syrup and some vanilla extract. And again, as always, when I bake gluten-free things, I like to mix different gluten-free flours. So I'm gonna add half a cup of an all-purpose gluten-free mix and half a cup of almond flour. And that's it for the dough, the consistency is perfect, so we're gonna move to the pan. And we're gonna take some vegan butter or any kind of oil that you have at home and we're gonna spread it into the pan and then we're gonna add one full scoop of dough. We're gonna make sure it covers all the pan. And when we see that the color start changing and it's starting to get dry, we're gonna flip it. And important here, we wanna cook it at a medium heat, so my, my hop gets to nine and I cook it at five, six, just like a medium one, medium low. We prefer it to take longer than to go too fast because if it burns, it's gonna lose the pink color that we just got. So the purpose of keeping it low is basically so the color doesn't get burnt or changed or anything because we wanna preserve it as pink as possible here. See all these spots that are getting dark? That's what you would get if you put it high. It's gonna get like all brown and that's not what we want. I, I was a little bit scared of the color being lost, but it's a little bit orangey, but it's really pink more than I expected. It's not extremely vibrant like it would be maybe with food coloring, but we're keeping it healthy here. So yeah, that's it. So now we're gonna start filling them. Maybe I did fill them up a little bit too much but the result is really really good and also the dough has this raspberry flavor because you can taste it like not a lot but there's like a different flavor to it which is really good so that's it for today's video I, I really hope you try it out even if it's without the raspberry if you don't want to do that you just like use a cup of milk and a cup of flour and that's perfect too and as always the recipe is going to be linked in the description of the video and with that said I'll see you in the next one